Hungary. Yes, Hungary. The fantasy home for every little girl who's young enough to love castles, but not quite old enough to be aware of neo-fascist political parties. <laughs> Hungary has had quite a week. Tens of thousands of protesters marching in Hungary. They're upset about a plan by the government to tax internet use. Tuesday's rally was the second in three days. This tax is the most stupid thing. Other countries like Estonia, they give internet for free to everyone. It is hard to disagree with the protesters when their argument is essentially, let's catch up with Estonia. <laughs> now, look, nowadays, a tax on the internet is never going to be popular. The internet is supposed to be free, like parking on a Sunday or drinks uh, at a wedding thrown by non assholes. <laughs> and it, it doesn't help that this tax is being proposed by a Hungarian prime minister who everyone hates. Prime Minister Viktor Orban is accused of becoming authoritarian. He admits to moving Hungary towards what he calls an illiberal democracy. He's close to President Vladimir Putin and speaks warmly of how they do things in Turkey and China. Wow. <laughs> that, that is three red flags in a row. <laughs> Illiberal democracy, close to Putin and likes how things are done in Turkey and China. If you just add he likes the way Hollister smells, we can officially <laughs> declare that man a war criminal. Now, look, Hungarians marched all this week, and the fact that people are protesting uh, the actions of an authoritarian government is not in itself a surprise. The shocking thing here was the result. Hungary is nixing plans for that tax on the Internet, at least for now. The Prime Minister says he is going to revisit that tax, though, next year. Holy shit. <laughs> the protest worked, and that is not a sentence you get to say out loud often. It's like, great one-man show, or Guy Fieri, that was delicious, or... <laughs> I met my wife at Dave and Buster's. You don't often... <laughs> the words feel weird coming out. But look, there is no time to celebrate, Hungarians. You're on the clock. If this tax is being revisited next year, you only have until 2015 to download as much pornography as you can. <laughs> Do it now and get it all. You don't know what you're going to be into this time next year.